Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ken here. I am just going to basically put my Mother's Day slash birthday weekend in review um, for today's vlog. Um, so without further ado, let's just get right on into that. So for all of you mothers out there, happy belated Mother's Day to all of you, whether you're a fur mom, um, a grieving mom, or side mom, whatever. Happy Mother's Day, happy belated Mother's Day. Um, I hope everybody had a wonderful weekend. Um, the weather here in Northern Michigan was absolutely perfect. It was like the high 60s and then for my birthday, which was Mother's Day, so May 8th, um, it actually cooled off a little bit um, and it wasn't as sunny. So with that being said, my birthday was still good, but the weather wasn't as great as uh, Saturday, May 7th here in Michigan. Um, but with that being said, on May 7th, I went over to my mom's to celebrate uh, my birthday, which is really just cake. Um, I did strawberry with buttercream frosting because that's just, I needed to mix it up. So that is the cake that I had chose to do. Um, and with that, with that being said, uh, I also went on May 7th, I went to a restaurant called Pearl's. It's a New Orleans themed restaurant in Elk Rapids. Um, and it's super good. I grew up going there my whole entire life. Um, so it's always kind of like a comfort food for me personally, um, just because I have gone my whole life going there. Um, but with that being said, so that night uh, we went to Pearl's, we went to my mom's for um, my birthday cake. And then um, we also ended up taking uh, Cohen to the park at the school that I actually went to school at, the elementary school. Um, they have a huge park there. So we took them to the playground. Um, and also my sister and my niece Hazley met up with us there as well and they just kind of have a big old ball so I will go ahead and place those videos right now.
So again, May 7th was like the main day that like I celebrated my birthday with my family. Um, so Mother's Day, May 8th slash my birthday, I turned 25. Like I got, I had said last week that I was turning 25. Um, and really and honestly, it was just kind of a laid back day. In the morning, I literally slept in until about 9.30. Um, and then from there, I ended up actually um, getting ready to go, which is sounds stupid, but like, I don't ever get like five minutes to myself to like actually get ready and like look nice and feel good about myself. Um, so I actually like had a full amount of time to sit there and actually get ready and I felt really, really good about myself. So I can definitely play some pictures here in the next couple of slides. Sorry, I like didn't know if I was going to sneeze, burp, I don't know what it was. But anyway, um, I will put those in the next slides towards the end of this video. Also on Mother's Day, we went to a cider place called Town Lion Cider Works. That's also in Elk Rapids. Um, and I had gotten their brand new drink. It's called, I think it was called like uh, Dancing Shoes. Um, and it's super, super yummy. I had two glasses of that. Um, and that's pretty much really what I did for my birthday on that day. I also went to my grandparents for Sunday dinner because that's just tradition. We always go to Sunday dinner as soon as they are back in town from Florida. Um, and so that's what we did for dinner was Sunday dinner at my grandparents. Um, but you guys are probably wondering maybe what I had gotten for my birthday and Mother's Day. So I will go ahead and let you guys know. So I have been saving breast milk since the very beginning of pumping. And I saved breast milk. Literally, I still have breast milk in my freezer right now while I'm talking to you guys. Um, so I've saved it because I wanted to make jewelry with it. Not me personally, but I wanted to send it into somebody that was going to make like a breast milk keepsake jewelry for me because I loved the idea of it. Breastfeeding was not like the most enjoyable journey for me. Um, and it really was the biggest mental toll and, you know, difficulty that I've ever gone through um, within myself. So with that being said, Logan did surprise me and, uh, get a necklace made for me. So it looks like, yay. It has some like rose gold s speckles in there. I will for sure post a better picture of it, uh, in the next coming slides. Along with that, he also got me an Alex and Ani. I should say this was from, from Cohen. Um, Cohen got me an Alex and Ani. Harry Potter love potion necklace, which I thought was super cute. Um, so I think that that was probably more so from Cohen for Mother's Day. And I also got a cute little tulip plant um, that I just have sitting up here on Cohen's Heath and Heart with Magnolia kitchen set over there just because it can get some sunlight over there. Um, but with that being said, that pretty much wraps up my birthday and my Mother's Day weekend. It really was not as like, crazy as like normal birthdays probably normally would be i just like to keep it low-key now at this point and kind of do my own thing um especially now that like i'm in my 20s and whatnot it's just it's just how i like it um so with that being said that's going to wrap up today's vlog it was going to be a super quick one for you guys thursdays is going to be more so um uh like a day in a life kind of vlog um, so with that being said, you guys are going to literally wake up with me until I go to bed and I'm going to leave you the very best that I can to keep you guys um, in the loop that whole entire day. But we all know how that can go sometimes. Um, so with that being said, I hope you all had a wonderful, again, Mother's Day weekend if you are a mom. Um, I hope you guys got spoiled or at least got to sleep in a little bit. Um, and yeah, I will catch you all in Thursday's vlog. Bye.